Hi Facebook! I just got my books in for my newest, the newest book I've published um, with my illustrator Albert Morales. And here's the box. So I'm gonna open it and see what is in it. So I've written lots of different genres. I write nonfiction, fiction, dystopian, fantasy fiction. This one is my second children's book. And these children's book, uh, children books help people, um, young kids who have body differences like birthmarks or missing limbs or um, just different things. And it helps encourage them that they were made um, special the way, the way they are. So they're called the Princess uh, Butterfly Princess series. And this is the second book in the series where she meets her new friends. Super excited. This is like the best part of writing books because they're so hard to write and edit and format and just all that stuff. Okay. okay. I'm really excited. I kind of want to look at it first before I show you guys. <laughs> is that bad? Okay. It looks amazing. They look absolutely amazing. Let me get one out or maybe two. Okay. There is a thunderstorm right now. It's lightning outside and thundering. So just to go along with the hurricane we just had too. Okay, so this is it. It's called Finding Her Friends. And this is um, Leia, the butterfly princess. And she has a birthmark right there, kind of like mine. And this is her, this is Ben the bee. He has no stinger. This is Dot, the ladybug. She has no spots. And this is Lee, the grasshopper, and he has no pegs on his legs, so he can't make music. And so they all have body differences. And then here's the back. That's me, the writer. And this is Albert Morales, the illustrator. And the cool thing about this book here, I'll show you some cool stuff. Okay. So I know how to format using Photoshop. I taught myself. And so if you go to one of the illustrations, I took one of the elements out of the illustrations like that flower, and I put the flower on the side with the words. So I did that on each page. So let me show you one more. Okay. So here's the hibiscus honey tea. And so she was drinking it. And so I had to Photoshop it and take out her hands and you know do a whole bunch of stuff, but it's a labor of love. The other cool thing about this book is that it rhymes. <laughs> and it was so hard to make it rhyme. It did not sound corny, but I think I did a really good job. The first book rhymed. And so I had to keep the keep it going and let all of it rhyme. And and it really pushed me as a writer to, because in a children's book, you not, you can't, you have to choose your words wisely. Sometimes it's more difficult to choose less, fewer words than it is just to be able to put more words. So I had to choose my words wisely and then I had to have them rhyme. So, so let me just read you one part. Lee hopped a leap and Dot fluttered a loop. Ben buzzed a sweep and Lee a flew a swoop. How happy and clever they were together. And best of all, they were friends forever. Four friends, true and true. Not one or three, but two and two. A bee with no sting, a grasshopper with no song, a ladybug with no spot, and a butterfly who wanted to belong. And so that is Florina and her friends. And she actually finds them in a very unique place. She finds them in one of those um, between two highways, a strip of grass, and she thinks she'll never find good friends there. It's an ugly place. But she realized that you can find friends in unlikely places. And that's kind of the theme of the book. And it says, this story is dedicated to all who have been beautifully marked by birth or life. Go discover diverse friends in unlikely places. And that's it. And this is the second book. 
Isn't that car awesome? Albert Morales is excellent at drawing and he really had to think about this for a while. It took him a little while because you need that inspiration. Creative people need the inspiration, but he did an awesome job. So that is the next book in the Butterfly series written by me and illustrated by Albert Morales. And it's available now on Amazon. It has no reviews yet because I haven't really been marketing, but I'm gonna, um, I'm actually part of a birth, uh, birthmark group. So I'm gonna um, donate a few to those people so they can um, share it with their kids. It's, it's uh, a group for uh, parents with kids who have birthmarks. So it's very cool. Anyways, it's out, Finding Her Friends. Butterfly Princess Book 2. And I think there's going to be five altogether. I think that's my goal, is to have five. So, because she's so special. That's Laia. Isn't she special? She's so awesome. Laia, Ben, Dot, and Lee. I had to pick names that were easy to rhyme. <laughs> but they're good names. Okay, so it's available on Amazon. It's on Kindle. And you can get it on um, the paperback and share it with your... Um, your kids, the kids who have birthmarks or burns or anything from life, or just two kids who need to be able to um, um, have empathy and be able to make friends beyond what they're used to. So it, it, will, it will encourage all kids. Okay, you guys have a blessed Saturday. Remember, Finding Your Friends is on Amazon. It's my 22nd book, so I'm really excited. Okay, have a blessed evening. Bye, guys.